I'm going to fix you. I can see your back. <laughs> Hi guys, Kelly here. I'm young inspired with Jamal. Who's and off me. on another sick day. And I'm us man in bed because you were being naughty in the video. Yeah, he was just being very naughty and silly. So he's upstairs banging away. Um, Jamal wants to show you the granny square that he's been doing. Take it closer. So he's learning the granny the granny stitch today. Um, he's really good at the half treble, these are UK terms. He's really good at the half treble, but now he's learning the treble and he's doing his granny stitch. So we're going to put that square on your blanket out when it's big enough. So he's actually helping me make his blanket. Isn't that good? Yeah. Are you enjoying it? Yeah. He loves his crochet. <laughs> um, what else? Are you okay? Yeah. I thought we was going to be sick then. We've Good. been, um, none of us have been polar, but we've just been projectile, spontaneous, vomiting. And now It's completely yeah. random. You don't even know it's coming until it comes. Um, Can I show this? Yeah. So this way, because that way's the back. So this is Usman's jumper. So just Mummy made it that. for him. Can you see it? Purple. White. Purple. Blue. Blue. White. Purple. What is oh, this? Purple. It's a different blue, darling. It's a different kind of blue. So, the blue, blue. Okay, they can't see that, so why don't you just come sit back here? Right, and that's using Aishan's Dancing Baby. I do not like this one. Um, I thought it'd be very similar to the Ice Magic, whereas it kind of is in the colour change, but it feels a lot rougher. And also, certain parts of it, it's like you'll come to a part where it's dead hard and you're there trying to like, sometimes you can pick out bits of plastic or fiber in, a, um, in acrylic wool, can't you? But with this, it's like there's glue dried on it or something, there's just really hard bits or like it's been singed but you can't see any burn marks. So, I'm not best pleased and I'm not going to buy Dancing Baby again. Even though the colours are really nice, I'm just, I'm going to stick with what I know and love, which is the magic. Um, so, on the subject of the kids' tops, I started one Jamal's. of the sleeves on Jamal's. And, and it's nearly done. They chose this sleeve to go on the one sleeve. And then it will be famous because there's not much sleeves to do. So he's very excited for it to be done. He it's wants a turtleneck on it, but I'm not no. sure if I'm going to have enough wool. Um, because this is almost half the ball gone and I have started this ball for the sleeve. Shall I try this off for you? But I'm sure I've got another bit somewhere, another bag. I just cannot find it. Look. <laughs> As you can see, you're super excited. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> Okie dokie then. So, the next one I've been working on is my top. Yes. And I need to buy a new headscarf to go with it. Yes, purple, 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 grey, white. Right, so I'm not going to show you all the ball bands again because mainly the Robin one for the grey is upstairs. So it's Robin DK anyway, just basic grey colour, 27. And then the bottom is Ice Magic. Um, I can't remember if it's Magic DK or Magic White. I think it might be Magic White. But I am loving the way this is turning up, turning out. 
And all this purple is done just using one ball. Cool. So. Well, look at this. Let's go on. So I think I might do. What's in her the table edging on my at the gym. top instead of buying another grey because I ran out of grey. I'm gonna do it in this purple. Um. And then do another couple of rolls on the sleeves just so it matches. And then I think there'll be loads left to make it into a tunic top rather than just a top. So yeah, that should be done pretty soon. And I think that is everything I've been working on. Um, and this is the white wool. I'm sorry I had to just show this you again. We had to just start it again because Rosemary would be naughty. Now he. Okay, do you want to lift it up though? Yeah. <laughs> I think he's going to end up wanting his own channel when he's older. Right <laughs> um, so, yeah, we're going to go because we're waiting for my friend to come. Well, she's not Auntie coming Annie, one. Auntie and Nisa. Auntie and Nisa. And it's only 5 to 11 now, Mela. Um. But also between one and four, we've got the washing machine repair people coming because all week my washing machine's been broken. Eep. So we've been having to hand wash, haven't we, in the sink? Yeah. And it's been killing my back. So I really need to get the situation sorted. And especially before Monday because I need to get his school uniforms done. And I know that it's going to be too hard for me with the white t shirts because that's a lot of scrubbing. Like, you can't just get away with just doing a little quick hand wash, like, white tops for someone like him. It's a lot of scrubbing. Isn't it? I'm not going to put a tail on my chin. I know. But like that. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go. Um, I hope you have a fabulous day. I might not film tomorrow, it depends on how we're feeling in this sick house. Uh, and that is it, but Jamal you did some painting though, didn't you? You painted the wall. Yeah, all by myself and I get two pounds. Yeah, I gave you two pounds, didn't I? So we went round with the roller and just um, doing all the dirt that he's put on the walls, all the drawing on the walls. Um, and he got two pounds for it, he didn't want me to do anything. So, um, you just sit down and you just crochet my sleeves on my top, mum. <laughs> like, okay, sorry. <laughs> See, you. and mummy said no, no, no drawing on the walls because we have to paint it again. Yeah, no drawing on the walls. You're too big for that now, anyway, aren't you? Five year olds don't draw on walls. It's not cool. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to go. Do you want to say bye-bye?